Accurate. And good afternoon, everyone. All right, it was a hot day today, all things considered for the middle part of October. Temperatures yesterday, mid 70s. We jumped about 12 degrees warmer than that today, 87 in Tulsa. A little cooler, like we said last night, over closer to the Arkansas border, but it was 90 at Poto, almost 90 at McAllister. We had low 90s out in central and western Oklahoma today, so that warm air jumped in here. Cold front tomorrow morning, that's going to shave about 8 degrees off, or maybe about five to eight degrees off the daytime highs today. Then we'll have an up, up and down temperature ride here through the end of the week. But what about rain? It's really getting dry and in the next seven days it looks very dry. We may not have any rain at all. Kind of a hazy summery look right now from our Midtown camera. Temperature 87 degrees, relative humidity 44%. Dew point, wow, right back up there in that humid area, in that category which we would consider humid. South winds currently at about 16 miles an hour, gusting closer to 30 miles an hour. This is a warm summer like pattern here with haze and Goodland in the lower 90s. Guyman at 94. There's the cold front still way up in Nebraska, but it is on the way later on tonight. We can kind of see the clouds associated with it on the satellite picture. Unfortunately, there's just not enough moisture in the atmosphere right now to get any kind of shower or thunderstorm activity going. So tonight the front's on the move. That red is the hot air getting squashed and pushed all the way down into central Texas. Then behind it, the air mass that's cooler lags a little bit behind it. So it finally shows up here a uh, late tomorrow afternoon and tomorrow night. So we'll drop to around 80 by about four o'clock tomorrow, likely a daytime high of around 43. And then Tuesday morning, we're dropping down back into the upper 40s. So if you're headed out to the fair tonight or uh, headed out for dinner or something like that, it's going to be really nice. 83, mostly clear at 7 p.m. And we're only down to 63 tonight, even though the cold front arrives at about 7 o'clock tomorrow morning. 58 in Bartlesville tonight. Pawnee down to 62. The winds will be calm. The sky's clear in our northern zones. Our central zones, we'll see lows anywhere from about 60 to 63 at Wagner. And our southern zones, calm winds, Holdenville 65, Henrietta, a morning low tomorrow morning of 65. Then 83 tomorrow, UV index high once again. Ragweed counts, we just can't shake the pollen. Wow. Grove tomorrow, 82. Miami, 82. And sky took around 84. Look at the northwest winds at 15 to 20 miles an hour. Central zones, those winds will get up to around 25 miles an hour. And we'll see high temperatures anywhere from 84 at Bristow and Sepulpa to 86 at Salisaw. And south of Interstate 40, we're getting closer to 90 here still. 85 Holdenville, 88 Tallahena, 87 at Stigler. Here's the seven day forecast going into Tuesday. 80 degrees after a morning low of 49, 82 Wednesday afternoon, morning low 53. Then Thursday, 85 cold front here Thursday, but no rain. Friday, it's down to 76, a little cooler. Saturday, 72, certainly some clouds, but we'd like to squeeze some raindrops out of those clouds. But right now, Brian, looks like it's a dry uh, up and down week, but not bad for the middle part of October. All right.